It's a video. Oh. <laughs> We on a boat. So as you can see, we are flying somewhere right now. And you already know, we went to Miami. We made it. Bienvenidos a Miami. Um, the flight was great. We flew KC to Fort Lauderdale. And we got to Fort Lauderdale, our friend Tim picked us up. That's him back there. Shout out to Tim. Todo de empate dá um cheiro a mulher. Vem cá. Nem consigo dormir direito de tanto pensar. Tô precisando dar um jeito de te conquistar. Oh, quem sabe só tem um jeito que é de agarrar. So we went to Versailles, which is a recommendation from our Uber driver. Uh, he told us that was the one spot that we needed to go to. So that was our number one priority. Cuban food at the OG Cuban food place. What you say? I got a rosy pollo y tostones. Dulce got some ceviche and some other pork dish. Omar got a Cuban sandwich. And Jessica got, I don't remember what Jessica got, but it was bomb. All this food was so good. We had leftovers even. This was our first stop at the beach. We were actually there maybe about 15 minutes because we were on the run, but we got we got a feel for the ocean and we got to enjoy some sun before we ran off to do more stuff. And this is actually my first look at the Atlantic Ocean. So thanks for being there with us. Here is my first dip in. Paradise. Oh man, we actually got an amazing Groupon deal. Let me just tell you about it. It was 39 bucks. It was a sunset cruise around the Miami Bay area. And uh, it was all you can eat, all you can drink. And it was gorgeous. This is the best deal of the whole of the whole trip. There's a video. This will be on the blog. The crew was fun. Everybody that was on board was fun. We definitely got kind of buzzed from all the wine and beer that we had. And we learned a lot. It was great. It was, I recommend. Five out of five stars. There's Lucy. It's a video. Oh. <laughs> hey everyone. We on a boat. Selfies. Who's she texting? Uh, so this is, we caught the sunset while we were out on the bay and look at these clouds guys. If there's anything I love, if there's not anything I love more than cl some cloud porn with a skyline. The weather was beautiful. Oh man, we were having a blast.
Miami so far? Okay. What's your favorite thing about Miami so far? The boys. Who? Art, culture, drinks, bad bitches. Yeah. What's your favorite? Good. <laughs> like, don't fight, dude. I would take that shit out of your hand right there. <laughs> okay, until we gotta do that. Woo! There's our destination. And then we're actually we're actually in South Beach. So for our second order of business was another Cuban restaurant that we heard about. It's called Las Olas. We got in there overwhelming scent of cafecito hit my nostrils and I was in love and then then I saw all the Cuban food uh, we came here twice during our trip I mean it was delicious it was quick it was convenient and affordable Sandwich was real good, but the the cortadito that I got, it was delicious, and it kept me up. <laughs> okay, so we're we're actually checking out South Beach right now. This is where all the people were at. That was right after we had just eaten, so I don't know if it was smart to go get, go get in the water, but I definitely fell in love with this place. Here we are, walking, beach, dulce. I love this city. Look at that. Look at that. Beach. Look at the beach is what I'm talking about. We actually ran into a bunch of people here. Not that we knew, but that we made friends with. So we ran into a couple that was doing acro yoga in the water. Uh, we ran into a group of people playing some jam. So we were kicking it with them for a while. And it was all around a good time. And there's just banners going around the whole time. Those airplane banners just uh, promoting all of the clubs that were having things going on for uh, Classico. It, it was just such a fun afternoon. I don't know how people in Miami must just have a ball doing this all day long. Just hanging out on the beach. So we did a lot of driving. So I got to know Miami from a car. I got to drive around. It wasn't just Ubers the whole time. And then not only did I drive around a lot, I got to ride in a helicopter and get to know the city. So that was a highlight of the trip. Um, I will say this. It was scary as hell. Uh, it was raining that day, the wind was coming in from the west, and we had a little bit of turbulence, and we were maybe 100 feet off the ground. Maybe 100 feet, I don't know. We were, we were real close, close to the, well, to the ocean. But it was a good time. Uh, my phone died right before we got on the plane, and then the camera died while we were on the plane, or on the, on the helicopter. Charge your devices, people. Because then, then you don't get the footy that you need. Uh, but I got I got some good footage here. Mostly I was trying to enjoy the view. Because uh, 
you know, not a lot of people get to see South Beach from a helicopter. It was a, it was a great experience. And I mean, look how busy it is. And this was a busy weekend. This was a, this was the weekend of um, El Clasico. So there are people all over the place enjoying themselves, having a good time. And I got, I got to, I got to ride around in a helicopter. Overall, my Miami trip was amazing. I had such a good time. Miami is such a cool city, and I will definitely be making it back as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching. You can find more vlogs just like this on our YouTube channel. We have some exciting videos coming up for 2018. You can also catch us on Twitter and on Instagram. Just look up The Relennials and listen to our podcast. We're on SoundCloud. Just search The Relennials there as well and you'll find us. And shoot us an email. We're at therelennials at gmail.com. Send us some advice. Say hi. Ask us questions. We'd love to hear from you. All right, everyone. Take it easy. Thank you for everything. Stay woke.